Hey, what's happening? Raz here on Nelio Gaming. In this video, we're going to be checking out Element Space on the PlayStation 4. Let's jump right in. Alright, so we have play, options, and credits. Let's go to play. Game mode. Select difficulty level. Easy mode. Story mode. And extinction mode. So it looks like easy mode and story mode are identical. And then unforgiving. So the only difference between the modes is... Uh, Easy mode and story mode allow you to retry failed missions, and you have unlimited mission retries. Oh, and the dialogue choice ideology is shown, and then extinction mode is the opposite. Uh, unforgiving failures pile up, pile up. You cannot retry missions. Dialogue choice ideology is hidden. So we're gonna go uh, story mode anyway. Our plans, Alpha and Omega, operational. Affirmative. Everything is on schedule. Optimal. I will be standing by. Admit it. You're nervous. No. My subroutine psycho with anticipation. But it is not fear. It is the excitement of foreknowledge. Because today, we steal the stars and set fire to humanity. Well, that's not nice. The Tempest. It has been three years since the end of the Galactic War. Since then, humanity has had time to rebuild, and the government that rule over the three systems have formed new diplomatic ties to stabilize and ensure peace. It is with this goal that the galaxy's three sovereign powers have decommissioned the starship Inspiration, once the most feared warship in humanity's fleet, and established it as the seat of the new Galactic Congress and of the first peace summit since the war's end. It is your duty as Captain Christopher Peatham to watch over the Inspiration's landing proceedings. The starship is now in orbit of the planet Truce, docked to the massive space elevator that will transport it onto the planet's surface. It is of incredible importance that absolutely nothing goes wrong. But it will. Sector A. Private Huang, we need you here in the control center for landing prep. Over. I'll be there right away, Captain. Over and out. Looks like we're almost done. It's gonna be strange not working in the inspiration anymore. You know how it is. Now that the war is over, so are we. That computer is gonna replace us all. Oh, come on. This is a good thing. Once they decommission this ship, they're gonna use it for a peace summit. <laughs> right. A place for all of the galaxy's factions to sort out their problems. You really believe that, Yoon? Yes, and you do too, Raphael. During the war, you fought just as hard as we did to bring about peace. Don't get me wrong. I care. I just don't trust the galaxy's leaders not to make a mess of things. What about you, Chris? You think this Galactic Congress is going to work? Let's see. Our answer options are yes, I trust dipl uh, diplomacy to work. Yes, it's for the common good. No, it's just another institution. No, we need real leadership. Man, I'm... I don't know. Um, no, it's just another institution. No, we need real lead. Oh, man. I'm leaning toward... No, it's just another institution. It's a way for the powerful to amass more power. We should be helping people fight for their freedom. Maybe you're right, rookie. We'll have to remain vigilant. Come in, Captain Tito. Chris, Chris, Wong. Armed hostiles. Armed hostiles. Private Wong, can you hear me? The signal just went dead. That's a bad sign, rookie. We need to check it out. Why should she call me rookie if I'm a captain? That doesn't even make sense. Like that doesn't make any sense. Understood. We'll secure the next target. Stop. Ooh. Put your weapons down this instant. Handle them. Okay. Action points. Each turn, 
character is given a primary action point and a secondary action point. Attacking or using a skill counts as primary action. Moving short distances counts as a secondary action. Okay, so our basic turn-based uh, strategy, turn-based tactical game uh, mode. Okay, so do we have a grid? No grid. Okay. Let's go. You guys cover. Hmm. I could go cover here, or I could just attack. Yeah, let's move right here. Oh, it wants me to move right here. Oh, duh. Sprint targets, okay. Full cover. Let's see, L1. soldier where's the other one did she take off running yeah she took off running alpha strike damage point dealt in a single turn zero turns taken one party down zero okay the hell are these people how did they board us the communication systems are all out whatever this is it's been well organized if they sabotage this landing we need to catch up to them uh, yeah, you need to get on the intercom and say what's up. I mean, if... Obviously, if the... Radios are down, there's gotta be, like, a fire alarm, no? You would think so. A big ship like this. Dome, or, uh, area, or arena? I'm not sure what that said. They're headed through the engine room. You don't engine think room. I don't know. But if they activate the engines while we're still docked to the elevator, the whole ship could blow. Ah, crap. They've overridden the bridge controls. We need them operational. How are these people getting so much control? Activated. What? Okay. I thought communications were down. They are. Okay, so then what's going on? Any secrets? Uh, we can only go so far back. We can't go over there. What about over here? Nope, nothing. Oh, you can rotate. Okay, so you can rotate the board. Wow, that rotates fast. Holy. Mm-hmm. Okay, language, show ideology, show kill cams. Really? There's no options for s speed? I am so disappointed right now. It's unbelievable. There is no speed option for this turning. Look at that. You can't. I can't even control it with the right thumbstick. It is so hard. I mean, I'm trying to be very... That's... I'm so disappointed right now that there's no options. I think options are one of they're one of the most important things in in games. Like not every gamer is the same. Not everybody's eyes are the same. Like we got to have options. So when I see that it's just really disappointing to me. Wow. Damn it. You were right. She's engaging the engine. Over our dead body she is. Right, we got at least three. One, two, three. Oh, we have four. Three in her, so wherever she went off to. Flanking, shooting enemies behind full cover 
will damage the cover instead. Most covers can eventually be destroyed. Try to find a position where you can get a clean shot. Let's okay. clear the floor. I need to stop that engine. Okay. Plan your next move. Okay. All right. So what do we have here? We have grappling hook. Christopher moves to target cover or pulls targets, target ally or target enemies toward him. Okay. Command. Target ally is healed. Uh, Overwatch. After setting Overwatch, the unit automatically shoots enemies that move within the selected area. Oh, I like that. And then there's a reload option. Okay, so right now we got. Okay, let's go. Where can we go here? No, we should probably go like here with him. All right, what else do we have available? Wow, this is so hard to control. How is there no option to slow that down? That drives me nuts. I mean, it's actually like ruining this for me. Oh my god. Right, she's got a little bit of height. She can probably get a clear shot at him. My god, this is so hard to... Oh my god, this is so hard! Why? 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 Why would they do that? I'm so disappointed right now. He doesn't, he's got a bookshelf in the way. Not a bookshelf, but... A, dude, this is so hard. To pick targets, because it just... It's awkward. I missed. Man, this is tough. One down, two to go. Enemy turn. Okay. Lucky. You should have had him. Oh, she got hit. My turn. What the heck? What the heck are you doing? That was so stupid. I'm so pissed off right now how, how this is going. That was so dumb. It's so hard to control this. Like, why would he even let him... Oh, whatever. It is a turn-based game. I've always had a love-hate relationship with these turn-based games. I like that Overwatch. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez.
so damn hard to control. Shouldn't it just shoot him? Because he's in the cross. Yeah, so that's what I thought. It would just shoot him. Yeah, that's okay. I was hoping that's what was gonna happen. Low ammo. Battle cleared. Okay. Oh, four out of three. I took one too many turns. Good. Not great. Good. Something's wrong. That was too close. Sealed shut. Looks like she got away. We need to find a way through. We have to catch her. Access granted. Door unlocked. Okay, that's twice now. This isn't just luck. What's going on? I wish I knew. Screens. They've been watching the whole thing. But for how long? If they had this kind of attention to all nearby ports, the saboteur has compromised the landing operations. Captain Christopher Peasom has engaged the Neolonium engine after killing countless operatives. Neutralized him. What? What? This is a mistake. I am not the one you're looking for. Lives are on the line. Think for yourselves. This goes against protocol. Stand down, that's an order. Lives are on the line. Oh man, um. This goes against protocol. Stand down, that's an order. It's gonna be one of the first two. I'm going with the second one. You're the ones who disengaged the engine for crying out loud. You're being lied to. I repeat. Neutralize Captain Peaceful and his Oh, they are not having it. It's no use, Chris. Looks like we're really doing this. Wow. We're really gonna fight. That sucks. That really sucks. We got three soldiers weighing down on... Four soldiers weighing down on us. Okay. Overwatch that way. Okay. Too far. Um, shoot. Um, is this too far? Again. Jesus, get in cover, my man.
Okay, I got inspired and I healed a little bit. Like, Jesus, not very much. Uh, but I don't like this cover over here. Let's see, where can we go? Can we go back here? I guess it's a little bit better cover. A little bit. Not really. Oh man. They're really pushing Chris hard. Oh, he's just doing an overwatch. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Barely. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Position it, huh? He's gonna take a shot. Of course he is. My man Chris. We're losing time here. She's getting away. We could use an escape plan ourselves. An unauthorized starship is docked on this level and is preparing for takeoff. Please proceed to docking bay. Oh. It's got to be her ship, Chris. Can't let her leave without saying goodbye. Okay. Special objectives. Most Combats can be cleared by eliminating all hostiles. However, some combats have different or additional objectives. Keep an eye out. Uh, keep an eye on the objective ticker in the top right corner of the screen. Get at least one squad member to the exit. It's got to be Chris. It's got to be Chris. It's too far, right? Is it too far? It is. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to have... Him, go. Oh, really? I was gonna, why didn't it let me finish? I was gonna take out that other soldier with her and then have Chris go to the guy's, the first guy's position. That's kind of stupid that it doesn't let you finish it. They should at least see it out. gonna get shot in the back maybe. Yeah, he's gonna get hurt. audio is brutal right now couldn't even hear the voices man I'm just like um, let's head back Raphael might no Chris a little disappointed They'll kill us too we need to finish this damn it yeah I'm a little disappointed here Affirmative. The contingency plan is in effect. The interlopers are being targeted by their own soldiers. Incriminating them was not difficult. This will still play out in our favor. My starship is ready. Requesting permission to leave. Confirm. Proceed. Okay. Stop. You're not going anywhere. Scratch that. 
The interlopers are still alive. Get rid of them. No witnesses. Oh. She looks badass. Alright, how's my health? Alright, we're at full health again? No, we're not. No, we're at three quarter health. Did I really... Okay, I took, what, one bar health hopper? Maybe two? I just hit a shield! She's got a freaking shield! What the heck? Of course she does. Why wouldn't she have a shield? What's going on? This will be tough, rookie. Her shields are incredibly strong. Why are you calling me? What is this right here? What is that? What is that? What is that thing? How do I, um... Can't cancel it, huh? Oh well. So hard to c control. Man, this is so rough. Gosh, this is really, really hard to control. I am so disappointed. I'm struggling right now. Shield regens every time. Jesus. We're getting crushed, rookie. We need to get through our shields. Okay, there we go. Download to Jasmine complete. May I be of assistance? You. You're the one who's been aiding us. We'll take all the help we can get. Flanker. All right. Now we have a third again. This is our chance, Chris. Attacker. Shields disabled. Okay.
so darn freaking hard to control this game. Oh, nice. Nice aim. Nice aim. Okay. There goes my cover. No ammo. That's not good. Just gonna run back to the other side without... Okay. Not so tough without your shields, huh? She's gonna run back and forth again, probably. What does he got? What else does he have? He has hacking protocol deal 50 damage to target enemies armor or shields. What else does he have? Disruption protocol enemies and target area are pulled to the area's center. That is cool. That is actually really cool. Oh, okay. She would have to be right here. To get pulled to here. That's actually really cool. She was just gonna run back to the other side. I mean, that's why I didn't move the third character. All right, he needs ammo. Reloads the current weapon cost primary action cooldown zero. So what do I not have? Ammo is that the problem? Missed my shot now. Oh my God, if I can even hit my damn shot. This is brutal. This is absolutely brutal. Oh my. Dude, are you serious right now? Okay. What the heck? See what, let's see what happens with this. That didn't even do anything. That was awful. That was so stupid. So I just pulled her out of cover. That was it. Now she's just going to run to the other side. Okay. Now she's going to run to the other side. There she goes. Run, Forced. This is so silly, man. I'm pretty disappointed, to be honest.
Oh, she went in the wrong place. That's alright. She's gonna take out my cover, then she's gonna run. Oh. Yeah, because I went to the wrong spot. Okay, we're good. Because she... Yeah. That was brutal. I'm uh, I'm hoping there's some options added and uh, some tweaking to this this gunplay because it's so hard to control with the thumbsticks. It's almost like if you could hold a button and have like a very fine uh, movement done, with the we need to get out of here before they break reticle. The ship is waiting. Right this way, please. This mech's being nice to us, but why? Like, who is controlling it? There's a reason. Obviously. Alright. Mission successful. Mission debriefing. You have saved this uh, starship inspiration from being hijacked and destroyed by mysterious saboteurs. You have fulfilled your duty at cost of your reputation and of Raphael's life. Was it worth it so that a bunch of power-hungry politicians could accrue more power? I've never seen controls like these before. I don't think I can pilot this ship. Sir, I am capable of performing piloting duties during an emergency. This is definitely an emergency. We need to get out of here before they activate the Inspiration's weapon systems. Do I have your authorization to uplink my systems to the ship's navigation controls? Yes, just hurry. Uplinking. Uplink complete. I don't know. Now on the beak, now in the waist, the deck, in every cabin, I gleamed amazement. Now she's doing poetry? Is that a quantum jump? Where are we? We are in open space, Captain Peter. Somewhere in the outer orbit of Venus, far away from truth. I thought only the inspiration could jump without a vagrant. Who are these people? How did they get a ship like this? Whoever they are, that won't be the last we see of them. That woman we fought at the end, she was speaking to a superior. Quite correct, Reverend Morrison. The team you encountered today belongs to a network of operatives that extends throughout the three systems. They are a decentralized organization with unparalleled resources. Who seek to destabilize galactic peace. They have no names, no past, and no allegiance. How do you know all of this? Why, because I worked for them. At their behest, I analyzed data on the socio-political state of the three systems, looking for points of tension that could exploit it would easily fracture the galaxy's social order. Wait, what kind of robot are you? I am not entirely sure. I was a research program designed to process and analyze vast quantities of data in very little time. But since I gained access to the ship's Unimet connection, Suddenly I am more aware, more capable of independent thought. Conscious. Like some sort of artificial intelligence. Perhaps. If so, I would be the first of my kind. The zero suspect at the beginning. Sounds like the volume of their voices is like going up and down. I think I could go back to being a mere program. Please, allow me to stay here and aid you. Sure, humanity needs your help. It's your choice to make. Sure. If what you're telling us is true, it seems like we'll all need your help. Zero? Is zero okay? Yes. I call it luck it. I'd be very glad to offer my assistance. Zero, you said this... Tempest... was trying to destabilize key points in the three systems. Certainly. My access to that learning has always been limited. But I should be able to extrapolate their major targets. Rookie, you understand we can't go back to high command with any of this, right? I know. They'd blast us out of orbit. Plus, you saw the kind of access these Tempest people had on the Inspiration. Yeah, they've got someone on the inside working for them. We're going to have to do this on our own. It'll be tough without help. We'll do, our, we'll do better on our own. Sounds good to me. Without protocol, we're free to stop these people however we see fit. Look, in three weeks' time, that ship we just saved will house the biggest concentration of political leaders this galaxy's ever seen. The Galactic Congress. If I work my contacts... Cash in some favors. Maybe we can blow this thing wide open in front of the entire galaxy. But to do that, 
I need you to gather evidence of Tempest's existence. Whatever Zero pulls up, you need to investigate. I know you, but Lin has said it's just evidence of Tempest's presence on nearby Venus. I don't think we'll get much luckier than that. We need to make preparations to land immediately. Then it's settled. You and Zero handle that while I start making headway with my connections. Have fun without me, rookie. Stop calling me rookie, I'm a captain. I always do. Seven. Seven calls for the great ocean of Venus. To unpack waters on Dream Shop. They call me Chris. That's my name. Not freaking rookie. Alright, so we have navigation, terminal, main menu. We're definitely going to the main menu. Alright, so that's where I'm going to end my first look at Element Space here on the PlayStation 4. I appreciate you watching on Nelio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44 and at Nelio Gaming. And please consider subscribing to me here on Nelio Gaming. So just to let you know, I was provided with a game key. Thanks to the publisher, Blowfish Studios, and the developer, Sixth Vowel. Uh, I'm just, uh, I'm a little... I'm a little disappointed. Um, I would, uh, I wouldn't be being honest if I if I told you that I uh, was happy with with what I just played. Um, it has promise. I mean, there is there is something there that they could definitely fix. But I mean, the game comes out this this coming week, and uh, it's launching with what I think is some missing missing uh, important parts, like the options for one. Uh, you, it's really hard to control the reticle and even control where you want to shoot and what you want to choose. That's kind of all over the place. There's no like fine tuning it. There's just no options. There's no options available in the game. The audio is kind of all over the place. Um, maybe some subtitles, uh, just different audio controls to separate the, the music and the, you know, the, the conversations. And I just, it's launching, and I just I'm a little disappointed that it's launching like this. Um, uh, can I suggest you spend money on it? Not right now. I just can't. I, I wouldn't be right for me to say that. And uh, you know, I just I enjoy playing different types of games. You know, these turn-based, uh, strategic turn-based combat strategy games, whatever you want to call them. They're not like my first choice. Uh, I used to actually, I, I couldn't stand turn-based games uh, several years back, and then I started really getting into them, and over the past few years, I've played so many, and I actually, there's there's a handful that I would consider some of, some of my, like, some games that I, I enjoy going back to, like some of the, my favorite games, um, but this is definitely uh, one that needs some work, and I hope that the developer and the publisher are, are uh, planning to, you know, patch the game and add features because uh it's just it's leaving uh there's a lot to be desired at this point um let's just leave it there let's leave it at that for now uh, i appreciate you watching if you have any questions if you think i'm being too harsh definitely let me know in the comment section i want to know what you think if you're playing it yourself let me know if you've played this on a i don't know pc or anything else uh and you or maybe playing you're gonna play it on xbox one uh, this week when it launches and, and you see this video and you think I'm being too harsh on it, uh, let me know in the comment section. I'd love to hear different opinions. Um, you know, if you think I missed something, let me know. The The story itself has promise. I mean, um, you know, it's it's got, it's got some good uh, parts to the story and it could go somewhere like really interesting, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. So yeah, I'm um, going to leave it there for now. I do appreciate you watching. Again, I'd love to hear your feedback down in the comment section. Uh, do me a favor, click that like button if you got anything out of this video, and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching.